I'm here to talk to you about uh, the Yellowstone Supervolcano. Uh, rocks have been my passion since uh, as a little child. I still remember the first rock I ever got. As you can see, I've been working out of my basement. The federal government has cut off all my funds to study the Yellowstone Supervolcano, thwarting my best efforts to save humanity. And I sit here and I wonder why I must bear the world's worries on my shoulders. We need to tell everyone out there what's about to happen. Yellowstone is a super volcano and it's about to blow. Starting January 27th, a quake storm erupted in Yellowstone and all the media attention has been on it because there have been 3.x magnitude earthquakes going off for the last whole freaking week. And it's gotten me so excited. We've been, we've been closely monitoring the quakes at, at this website that we go to. What can be more uncomfortable than eating a lot of cheese and having it build up and feel like you're gonna make farts? That's a lot like Yellowstone. Everyone's heard of Old Faithful and it erupts like clockwork, right? Well. Yellowstone erupts like clockwork too, and the clock's ticking on you. When the Yellowstone supervolcano finally explodes, there will be a hot column of magma and ash shot up into the atmosphere, 15 miles, to get a sense of the scale of the disaster. Picture a five mile stretch of road. Now picture two more of those connect them all. So when Yellowstone erupts, everyone within 60 miles will be killed instantly. Their bodies will be blown apart, of course. And then outside of that, depending on which way the wind is blowing, you're going to see ash fall from the sky in some places as thick as, oh, two Magic Johnsons. That's what, about 24 feet? If we could travel to the future and Yellowstone had already erupted, what would we see? Mass devastation on a global scale, crops failing, lots of people dying. 64,000 years ago in Toba, Indonesia, a super volcano erupted and dwindled the entire world population to only 10,000 people. Like Marty McFly said in Back to the Future, this shit is heavy, Doc. So that's, uh, these, these new quake storms in Yellowstone are therefore very troubling. We have to ask ourselves, is the end coming soon? And when I listen to The Rock, I think The Rock says yes. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm gonna do when the Yellowstone supervolcano erupts. I have no wife, no kids. Some would say no life. Uh, but if the internet is still up, I can still masturbate. Don't matter.